In this video, we bash some RC crawlers and guys, we're going RC crawling, but first, I've got to have a little look at my TRX4. So this hasn't actually been out in a while and I've done quite a lot of work on it since I last used it. So let's do a quick run through. So I've added these arches and they're a bit of a bodge, but eh, you know, I'm going to have to do them again. They kind of just slapped on there. I was in a hurry, I was in a rush and I kind of, nah, anyway, forget about that. But anyway, what I did was I moved the battery location from up here to down here, which brings the center of gravity right down. Then I put the receiver up here. Also running in here, we've got a Castle Mamba X system. So this can actually run on 6S LiPo. I mean, the ESC is rated for 6S. Uh, this isn't, even though it kind of has taken it and it was stupidly fast. So I'm going to put a link to that video up here and you'll be surprised how quick this thing is. Up front, I've just got a cheapo servo. I can't remember the exact one. It's a Ripmax something or other. And then on there is a Yeah, I think it's from Yeah Racing, Servo Saver, because I kept killing servos. Because I actually bash these. People keep telling me in the comments, Kev, you're not supposed to bash them. They're a crawler. But I'll do bash them, so I've got to make them a bit more bash proof. And this is going to be the first time I've run it with this Servo Saver. So we'll see how we get on. So what I have to do is, in order to run normal body shells, if you have a look at these arches, look. Well, Americans are going to call them fenders. They're actually getting in the way of the body, so I'm going to have to cut these down. I mean, I don't really want to cut them down, but all the body shells that I have have to fit on there, so I'm going to have to cut them down. All right, so I've just marked around here where I've got to cut it. So I've got my Dremel here. I've got my little cut-off saw thing in there. So let's cut them off. Safety's number one priority. Oh, what? There's something missing. Is that a motor brush? Ah... Oh, I found it, but it was broken, so I kind of had to bodge it in there. All right, let's try again. All right, let's check it out. Hey, it's on. A lot of people keep asking me about this body. It's actually a Toyota Hilux body, and I tried to replicate the Top Gear Hilux. It's not the exact model, but yeah, it looks kind of similar. And I kind of, to get all the dents and stuff, I got a hot air gun and then just heated it up and pushed it in just to sort of create these dents. That video is somewhere. If I can find it and remember, I'm going to put it in up here somewhere or up here. <laughs> oh yeah, look at all this stuff here I've got to fix up. Creighton needs new electrics. The rustler's broken in half. Uh, yeah, the slash is broken in half as well. Little A959 project going on, on here at the moment. This is a manta ray project where I'm trying to get my old, my first ever RC car back in action. Over here we've got the V-car bison. Simple fix this one, just got to put that shock back on. Alright, let's go bashing. The high lap climbing the windscreen. Hey, don't want to bust it just yet. Is it speed run? Two, one, go! <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> what happened? Three, two, one, go! Uh, not much in it. Uh oh! <laughs> oh Three, two, one, go! Where are you going? Hopefully, hopefully there's no dog poop. Alright, challenge. We've tried it before and always failed. You've got to hit this thing here and go through the hole. But this body's already taking some damage, look. I don't know if it's, if it's cold or what's going on. No. Oh! oh. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Should we give up before they're dead? Yeah. Hey! Oh, 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 nailed it! Oh! oh, oh. Let's have a look at the whip for that. Well, so has that got an MIP extended axles? Yeah. And, and extended hexes? Yeah, I think it was five mil. Oh, looks good. <laughs> oh, carnage. Take any route you want, you just got to get in that cave. 
He's got the added benefit of wider axles. Oh no, I'm at the bottom. Oh no, he's won. Hey. <laughs> I will not be defeated. Doesn't look very steep, but it actually is pretty steep. Hey, upside down. What have you put in the bottom of your shocks? They brass bottom caps. Yeah, I'll put up the Well, how do they hold on? Oh, so they can't fall off. Right, we're in low gear now. All diff locks in. We're going to try and crawl it first. And then, if I can't get out there by crawling it, we're going to try a bit of run up. Oh, that's going everywhere. It's tumbly wumbly. <laughs> but Ian's got the advantage with the wider axles. Mine's, oh, mine sucks on side slopes. But even though I've got the lower centre of gravity battery in there, I'm the one that set this challenge and I can't even get up there. God, this could be it. Oh, this could be it. We're making it. Oh, yes. We're at the summit. And he makes it! Alright, let's see if we do a controlled crawl down this little rock section here. You do it again just to rub it in. The added whip is definitely helping. And he makes it! Well, I'm going to give it one more go as well. I'm going to start from down here. Hey, we're up! <laughs> oh! You probably helped me get over that obstacle. All right, so we've got a challenge set, and the challenge is you've got to get up this bit, onto that, over that, over that, to where I am here, and from there you've got to get over that, over all this lot there, round there, and then round over there, you've got to get round that tree there. And the first one to do it wins. All right, three, two, one. Oh, I got there first. <laughs> is, it, is it contact allowed? Yeah, why not? <laughs> oh, I'm up there now. Oh, you're off the back off from it, Ian, guys. Go on, Ian. Go on, Ian. <laughs> oh, first bit. Get it all close to your camera, Patrick. Is Ian giving up? Thank you. Ian. Oh, look at that, straight over. Oh. Oh, no, I can't see what's going on. <laughs> Oh, I've got a, got a front oh. wheel caught in a hole, look. Well, I'm going to come back for a bit of the action for me in here. Oh, I've got to get that back in. If I'm getting that back end to drop in. Oh, I think I've saved, oh, I've saved it. All right, here we go. Oh, and he's... Got a high speed, bit of wheel speed. Oh, and we made it. Oh, get us through. Get us through. All right. Oh yes! Oh, and he makes it! Nice shot there. Oh, look at that, straight Very round. Top. Without even looking from here. Oh! <laughs> now, can Ian do it? Right, Carl. Did you get up the first bit or did you cheat? Yeah, I got the... <laughs> oh, wow. oh, oh nice, he's back up. Nice. Go on, oh yeah, he's, he's got past that bit, this bit you've got to go slow, because if you fall off, then you're done. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, oh, if you touch oh, it. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh. Ah. <laughs> All right, high Reset. speed. <laughs> this first bit's the hardest bit. Come this way a little bit. That's it. Forwards. Left. That's it, yeah. yeah. Oh. Right, and then right up down. Oh, oh no. We've got a yes, flex going on, look. It. Put some flex going really? on. Uh, come back straight a little bit, that's it, yeah. Oh, and Pat's gonna get his go in a minute. <laughs> uh, come back a little bit, and then go left, yeah. Yeah, yeah a little bit, oh yes. Yeah, Is it our steering guard is in the way? Yeah. Oh, slipper clutch. Oh, slipper clutch. <laughs> I think you've got to go that way a bit more. Yeah, he's moving over more and more. He's oh, he's going to fall off. <laughs> <laughs> the bit I struggle with is that first piece here. 